Hello, boys and girls. Hello, mommies and daddies. Welcome to another episode of Learning with Daddy Henry. My name is Henry. My name is Emma. My name is Lucy. And he's our Henry. That's me. And today we are going to talk about rock collecting. Yay! Yeah. Now, as you can see, we have um, Emma's rock collection over here and uh, Lucy's rock collection over here. Everyone, please say rock. 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 Another name for rocks is stone. Everyone, please say stone. 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 Yes. Now, what is the difference between a rock and a stone? Do you know? Do you know? Stones are smaller and can move it. It's the other way around. Uh, actually, stones... Wait, did, did you say stones are smaller and you can move them? Yeah. Okay, she is right. I am wrong. That's right. Now, why is it called rock collecting when you're taking the rocks home? I don't know. Anyways, let's get to it. Now, Emma looks like she's got some rocks and stones, but uh, as for Lucy, they're quite tiny. I don't even think they're stones. I think you have to call them pebbles. Everyone, please say pebbles. Pebbles, pebbles. Pebbles. Very nice. Okay. Now, there are very, 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 very many things that are very, very useful when it comes to rock collecting and stone collecting for kids. The fir first thing is, everyone, please say sorting. 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 That's right. So, you can organize your rocks according to their sizes, to their colors, right? right? And uh, to their weight. Okay. So, children can learn how to sort. And another way of uh, learning through rocks is called ownership. Everyone, please say ownership. 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 That's right. Now, we're, we're people, right? We like to own things. Like, you know, Lucy wants a spider. And Emma, what do you want? I want a dog. Yeah, she wants a dog. But um, here's the thing. There, there might be a, a lot more uh, effort in owning a, 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 a spider or a dog, but mommies and daddies, rocks are free. And, and they don't poo. And you don't need to feed them. Okay, so let's start with rock. So, oh, sorry, I forgot that I was just not talking to, to more than just the kids and the mommies and daddies. Okay. All right. So, uh, and, and another very useful thing is everyone, please say counting. 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 Very good. How many rocks do you have, Emma? Five. Yes. Well, can you count them, please? One, two, three, four, five. And how many pebbles do you have, Lucy? Five. Okay. Can you count them, please? One, two, three, four, five. All right, here we go. Now, this is where things get a little bit more interesting. Everyone, please say storytelling. 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 All right, I have done enough talking. Emma, tell us about your rocks. So, this is my first rock. It's the Charlie Rock. It's the Charlie Rock. Oh, we miss you so much, Charlie. And Why is it the Charlie Rock? Because one day on the way back home, I got mad at her because she left me alone again. I remember that. And so I grabbed the rock and I put it on the floor and I kicked it back home. <clears throat> you kicked Charlie Rock all the way back home. And that's when you found out. Really? Uh-huh. Wow, I remember that day very well. So um, if you can punish your sister, you will punish the Charlie Rock. Yes. Okay, uh, uh, yeah. what about you? What, what, will, will you show us one of your rocks? Storytelling? Yes, what, what is that one? You, you don't know. I don't know. You don't remember. I just, I just think it's pretty. You just think it's pretty. Thank you. Uh, uh, okay, well, moving on to the next topic. Everyone, please say memory. 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 Now, Lucy, do you remember where you got that rock? In the park. In on the, the ground. park. On the sure, on the ground. <laughs> that that <laughs> would that tree. would make sense. Yeah, <laughs> rocks are usually on the ground, not not in the tree, right? Right, right. Okay. Uh, and um, do you remember the day? Was it sunny or is it rainy? Sunny. Yeah. Why? Why would you be at a park if it's a rainy day? <laughs> okay, so. 
memory. All right, very nice. Speaking of sunny and rainy days, everyone, please say nature. Nature, nature. Where do rocks come from? I was about to ask. Nature. No, it's like what part of nature is rocks? Volcanoes. So you're telling me that there's so many volcano explosions I can fly all over countries? Yeah. That's scary. No, it's yeah. okay. That's scary. 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 It, we we don't have any live volcanoes in Taiwan anymore, so I think we're safe. Okay, and even in Hawaii, they have live volcanoes every day. We'll talk about Hawaii a little later. Okay, so. A very good way for your children to get closer to nature. Last but not least, everyone, please say soothing. Soothing, soothing. That's right. Now, owning these rocks and these pebbles or these stones can, you know, be very soothing to your children as opposed to using those popping fidget toys and tops and other things and whatnot. This is the very natural way of learning how to soothe. And comfort yourself, and once again, moms and daddies. Is... And comforting yourself. Yes, very good. Now, would you two like to talk any a little bit more about your rocks, Lucy? Your stones or your pebbles? You, you you told me a lot more about them yesterday. Tell me about this one. It looks like a coral. It looks like a what? Coral. It looks like a、no. coral. It could be a coral. I'm not a rock expert or a stone expert. And what about this one? It looks like a shell. It looks like a shell. There you go. Did you get all of these at the park by your house?、Mm, yep. Okay. And Emma, you 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 have more than just a Charlie rock. What else do you have? I have a Daddy rock.、Uh, okay. Uh, here, here. Hang on a second.、Mm -hmm. Daddy, Dad. And we have a Mommy rock.、Mm -hmm. She's bald because she always changes her haircut. She always changes her haircut, Mommy Jasmine. So, so you can have a permanent one, and, right? But if you feel the difference, this one's heavier. Oh, mommy rock is. What, what does that mean? Nothing. Are you trying to say something? <laughs> no. Okay. Well, well, we met. We already met Charlie Rock, right? Charlie. It's got her name on it and everything. And what's that one? The Emma Rock. The, what What is so special about the Emma Rock? Why is it the Emma Rock? What do you think? What Why is it the Emma Rock? <laughs> Last but not least, this is the the Lucy Rock. Why is it the Lucy Rock? I don't know because it's smaller.、Oh, because because I don't know. I know. Because I don't remember. I don't remember. Because I don't know and I don't remember. And that is why is the Lucy Rock. Get it? Wait, wait. I want to try and stack the stones. <laughs> Here we go. So, mommies and daddies, rock collecting is a very, very good、um, option, free option for your children. Once again, my name is Henry. My name is Emma. My name is Lucy. And he's our Henry. That's right. Yeah. Go enjoy stacking your rocks. Okay, now one of the most important things that we talk about here at Daddy Henry is everyone, please say ask first. Ask first. Ask first. That's right. Now, boys and girls, there are certain places where you cannot take the rocks and the stones home. For example,、uh, when I went to Hawaii, the Big Island, there are some very big, beautiful black rock, but It's not okay to take them home. Same as Penghu. So I guess it's fine when you're around your park, like Lucy, or on your way home. But remember to ask first. Okay? Thank you. <laughs>